Welcome to yet another Adobe Monday. My goal here is to go straight to the point without wasting your time every single week. This is part 21 of this series, which is also the first one for Adobe Photoshop. Today we'll learn how to easily remove the background from any image. Are you ready? Back in the day we had to use pen tool to make selections and then remove the background that way. As you can see, that was a very time consuming process. With Photoshop evolving, this became just one of the options on how to remove a background. So, unless nothing else works, just don't do it that way. Simply just find a tool named Object Selection Tool. If you can see it right away, look for it under the Magic Wand tool, which I'm sure you know where it is. The logic behind this is to draw a rectangle over the object you want to cut out, and then Photoshop will automatically detect the object and will make a selection for you. Anyway, once you have the selection ready, create a mask and then double click on it. This will open a new window with advanced options to refine the selection. Look at this ugly edge we got from making a selection earlier. No worries though, just drag this brush over the edge and voila! I'm not sure if we can say there's artificial intelligence helping us or not, but it definitely feels like it. Look at this fur, it looks so good just with the help of this crazy useful tool, which Loki finds an edge and then also adjusts the opacity of the mask. Again, automatically. Sometimes it's hard to see if everything is right without the background. So, just put a one color background to another layer behind your subject and check for errors. And get rid of them, of course, with the same tool. Make sure to experiment with other tools in the same window, which might also be useful to refine the selection. And here it is, that was fast, right? All I'm asking you is to like this video and subscribe. There will be more videos like that every single week. Thank you so much for watching and see you on the next one.